What's up, everybody? And welcome back to another awesome Planet Fitness workout with me, Teddy Savage. Coming to you guys from my home club in Baltimore, Maryland, and I'm super excited to be back. Now, when you guys get back into the gym, let's be sure to be clean, considerate, and practice social fitnessing. And that's just keeping a safe distance between you and your fellow members. Now, take a look where I am, guys, back in our express area, the 30-minute circuit. And it's cool because you get a total body workout in, you guessed it, 30 minutes. Now, it combines strength equipment with cardio, and it's labeled 1 through 20. Now, today, we're going to be doing things a little differently, and I'll only be using a portion of the circuit behind me, okay? That's because you're going to be interchanging strength and cardio in a different way. But when you guys get back into the club, please do the entire circuit, 1 through 20. That way, you get a total body experience. Now, you guys know what I like to say. Before any great workout, we got to start with a great warm-up. So let's get cooking, baby. All right. Now, before any rigorous activity, you want to do a dynamic stretch. So that means we should be moving. I like to start from the top of my body and work all the way down to the floor. So let's get a couple of step and reach, just like this. You guys join in. Don't let me have all the fun, baby. So I'm getting blood flow to my muscles, and I'm lubricating my joints to offset injury. Notice that when I step, I'm keeping the balls of my feet down, but I'm raising my heel off the ground. That's called pivoting, so I want you guys to pivot. Good. Breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth. Supplying the body with oxygen is key. Now let's change the level that we're reaching, and let's go chest high. Now I really want you to get a good pivot and a good turn because this now engages our core and our low back. Notice I'm keeping my chest, shoulders, chin, and eyes moving as one in the same direction. Three, two, one and relax baby all right now let's continue to work our way down the body and hit our core when i say belly button to the spine i really want you to squeeze those abs get those shoulders back chest out in front i want you to have your hands up above your head drive your left knee up and come back down then we'll switch and do the right side you guys ready let's go so we'll go for about 20 seconds here drive it up exhale as you come up inhale as you go down good make sure you focus on posture posture is important when you work out it's important in life as well. Good, we got five, four, three, two. Now let's switch sides, baby. Let's go opposite side. Here we go. Good. Now as you go, guys, I really want you to remember that working out should be fun. It should be a choice. So remember to have fun. Smile big. It makes your workout more effective, I promise. Keep going. Drive up. Good. Exhale. Squeeze. Here we go. Five, four, three, two. And relax, baby. Outstanding. Okay. So we got the upper half of our bodies up. And let's wake those hamstrings up, okay? We'll do a couple of toy soldiers. I'll show you guys from the side. I want your hands up and kick opposite foot to opposite hand. And if you can't get that full range of motion, just drive the knee up and come back down. You guys ready? Let's go, baby. Here we go. Good. We're kicking. And when you get a stretch, you should feel slight resistance in the back of your leg. So it shouldn't be painful, but you should feel... Those hamstrings waking up and saying, oh, baby, I can't wait for this workout. Keep going. Exhale when you kick. Good. Now exhale and breathe out. Again, supplying those muscles with oxygen. We got five seconds. Five, four, three, two, and relax, baby. All right. We're almost done. And then we're going to get into the meat and potatoes of this whole thing. We're going to get spicy and saucy, okay? So the last thing we like to do is jumping jacks. It's an oldie, but it's oh so good. Now, for modification, step out to the side, back, alternate sides, and return. You guys ready? Here we go, baby. Smile big. Let's get it. 30 seconds. Chest up. Chin up. Eyes up. Smiling big. Ear to ear. Remember to engage that core. I want you guys to have a strong core at the end of this workout, okay? And in the comments, let me know which exercise was your favorite. Let's see if we can build on that throughout these workouts, okay? Five, four, three. Two, and relax, baby. All right. So let me explain how we're going to do this, okay? We're going to go strength. We'll go upper and cardio. Lower, then cardio, core, and keep repeating until we're done 14 stations, okay? I'm going to use my water bottles for some of those weighted movements. You guys use whatever you have at your disposal. We'll work for 60 seconds, then have 30 seconds to transition, catch our breath, and then go right back in. You guys ready to get saucy, baby? Let's get cooking. Okay. So I've got my weights here, my Planet Fitness water bottles, and we'll start with a curl transition into a hammer curl for our biceps. You guys ready? 60 seconds. Let's go. So we're curling up, palms out, switch, 
palms in into the hammer curl. Okay, now this is really good for the biceps, but also forearm and grip strength. So when you guys go to the, the grocery store, baby, and you're picking up those bags, this is exactly what this exercise is meant to improve. An exercise should mimic daily function. Good, I'll show you from the side. Remember, we want our shoulders back. We want our chest up, chin up, and eyes forward. Good, take your time through the exercise. That means time under tension, okay? Try to count three, two, one, down, one, two, three. Just like that, okay? Especially when you're using a light weight because time under tension helps to develop muscles properly. There we go. Again, hammer curls, palms out. Now we go regular curls, okay? Palms in, squeeze. That's what I'm talking about, baby. We got five seconds, five, four, three, two, one way to finish strong, baby. All right, so now we got 30 seconds and we're gonna get into our high knees, okay? I'm gonna show you guys how you can do it if you're in the gym on one of these steppers over here, and I'll show you how you can do it at home. So if you're back in the gym, it's one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. If you're back home, we got high knees. One, two, three, four. All right, here we go. Breathe in, breathe out, smile big. We got five, four, three, two, showtime, baby. High knees, here we go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Now make sure you focus on that knee drive and that arm swing, okay? As you do high knees, it should be working the hip flexors and those lower abs. But again, this is total body as I rotate from my shoulders. Let me take it to the box, baby. Let's take this show in a row. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Make sure your entire foot gets up on that platform. One, two, three, four. Breathe in through your nose. I'm coming back out through your mouth. If you can get a little bounce, go ahead and bounce a little bit, okay? You guys know what I like to call that. That's getting saucy, baby. Make sure you step over the opposite knee. Really drive those knees up. Breathe in through your nose, out through your mouth. There we go. If you start sweating, you start glistening, just smile and say, where you been all my life, baby? Here we go, five, four, three, two, one, and relax, outstanding. Okay, so this next one we're gonna do, guys, is a lateral lunge into a back lunge, okay? So I wanna stand about hip width apart with my foot placement. I'll go lateral lunge, up, back lunge, and back. For modification, just go down to your range of motion, and then take a pronounced step back. So we'll go 30 seconds one leg, 30 seconds opposite leg. You guys ready? Into your nose, out through your mouth. Five, four, three, two, showtime. Chest up, butt back, good. Step on back, outstanding. So a lateral lunge is really good for those abductors and hip muscles. The back lunge is really good for the glutes and quads. Keep going. Outstanding job. Remember, we're doing right leg first. And when I say switch, we go left leg. Keep those weights right here. So this is a front load exercise because we have our weights in the front. Good. <laughs> Exhale on effort. Inhale on resistance. Take your time through the movements. Right time under tension. Remember that. Here we go. Let's switch. There we go. Good. We're stepping out and coming on back. Chest up. Smile big. Eyes forward. There we go. Good, remember, modification step, and then pronounce step back. Outstanding, here we go. Sink down into it for your range of motion. Come on back, finish strong. Remember, that's a mental thing. Five, four, three, two, last rep, best rep, and <laughs> relax, oh baby. Let me put that down, okay. So now we got 30 seconds to breathe, supply those muscles with oxygen, exhale. So now we got skaters for our cardio. For a skater, if we want to step, sweep, reach. Step, sweep, reach. If you can, you can add intensity by hopping and adding that sweep and reach motion. You choose, but remember, your work equals your results, so you go at your own pace. Five, four, three, two, showtime. Here's the modification. There we go. Step, sweep, reach. Step, sweep, reach. If you want to get saucy and push yourself, here we go. It's a small plyometric hop. Plyos are great for burning more calories because they exert more force on the muscle. Good, exhale, inhale, outstanding. Small hop, you don't have to jump out of the roof. Again, small hop, step, sweep, reach, step. When I say reach, cross the midline of your body, just like that. 
All right, modification, we're here. Outstanding. We got 20 seconds, and you can do anything for 20 seconds. Just make your mind up, and you can achieve it. Here we go. Last 10, best 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Last one, two, and <laughs> relax. Oh, baby, it felt so good. All right, so again, we went upper, then we went lower. Now let's hit core. All right, so I'll get my weights. I just want to do a couple of standing crunches. So I want you guys to act like you're kind of a scarecrow. Right here, drop opposite knee to opposite elbow, okay? Are you guys ready? Breathe in. And now, tell yourself, I can and you will. I can, I will. Now it's showtime. Let's see it. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Good. Once you get the mechanics, then let's have some fun. Chest up. Smile big. Eyes forward. Bounce a little bit. Hum your favorite tune. <laughs> Hum your favorite tune, baby, whatever it might be. Okay? Anything goes, right? Fitness is fun. Color outside the lines. Be creative. Do what you want to do. Good. Just keep on moving and grooving, baby. Modification. Just don't come up this high. Get that good twist. Belly button to the spine. Chest up. Posture is key. Exhale. Good. Keep going. And listen, you can work abs and you don't have to go down to the ground, which is outstanding, okay? Keep going. Chest up. Chin up. Eyes forward. Keep pushing. You got about 10 seconds. Last 10. Best 10. Five. Four, three, two, and relax. Oh, baby, that last rep is always the best rep for me. Okay, so now we're gonna do some side to side butt kicks to really get the hamstrings and glutes engaged. So it's a step, butt kick, step, butt kick. Just like that. If you wanna speed it up, you could just run in place, but really focus on, on driving those heels up to your buttocks, okay? Breathe in, breathe out. Tell yourself I can. And you will, baby. I believe in you. Believe in yourself. Let's go get it. Five, four, three, two, showtime. Step, side to side, butt kick. Going side to side. I like to dance a little bit when I do these side to side butt kicks. So you might see me moving those hands up and down. And that's just me having fun with fitness. And you guys should have fun with fitness too. But again, if you want to get saucy, then we're going here. Remember, pump those arms, heels to the glutes. Keep going pump and we're really waking up those hamstrings when you do it blood flow to the muscles improve performance blood flow to the joints offset injury remember that keep going drive smile eyes up smile big baby it's fun it's getting better let's get better today five four three two and relax oh baby hey look here's the thing every single repetition you give make sure you give all your effort and your effort equals your results, not anybody else's, okay? So now we're back to the top of the body. We're gonna do what we call Arnold press. So I want those elbows up, parallel to the floor. Press up, exhale, and down, making sure we stay at parallel or 90 degrees. For modification, go lighter weight or no weight at all. Focus on mechanics. Three, two, one, let's work. Drive it up. This is really good for shoulders and triceps so as you press above your head you engage those triceps and remember form technique effort i'll show you from the side form is making sure those arms are at 90 degrees technique is as i drive i exhale up and effort baby we just go keep going push tell yourself you can and you will chest up shoulders back belly button to the spine oh baby i love it keep going remember we're more than halfway there Everything you got and every repetition you give. We got 12 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, push, 4, finish strong. 3, 2, and relax. Oh, baby. Oh, baby, let me put those down. So good. Now, I want to go back to my football days and we'll do what we call fast feet. Now, fast feet is really good for the calves, hips, quads, hamstrings, and glutes. You know what else is really good for? The heart. We're going to get that heart rate up and burn calories. So all I want you guys to do is chop just like that. We'll go 10 seconds at a time. You guys ready? Breathe in. And out. And chop. 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 Fast feet. Rotate those arms. Notice I got my butt back. I got my shoulders over my knees. 
my knees over my toes. Three, two, one, and then tap. And we're gonna go back in. And we're gonna do that same thing again, okay? Ready? Cha, 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 forward. If you're feeling saucy, go side to side. Move forward, all right? Move backwards, just like that. Now step, step, because I know it's burning. But when it burns, just smile. They say, where you been all my life? Last time, best time, let's chop. 10 seconds, 10, nine, eight, seven, six. Finish drawing five, four, three. Coming at you, two, and one, baby. Oh, wow. That is awesome because it's not only a cardio move, but it also wakes up those muscles in the low body, okay? Let's get our weights again. We wanna do squat front kicks this time, okay? So, I'll show you from the side. When you squat, make sure you push those hips back as you lower yourself to your range of motion. If you need to, go three-quarter squat and up. What we're also gonna do is make this a compound exercise by adding a front kick and alternate. You guys ready? Three, two, one, showtime, baby, here we go. Squat, front kick, squat, front kick. Remember, if you need to modify, that's okay, because you listen to your body and you get the results from your effort. Good, push, exhale when you kick, outstanding. Hey, and if you gotta take a break, don't forget, every minute is mighty indeed. I'll show you from the side, three quarter squat, kick low. Three quarter squat, kick low. We'll run this together. Push yourself, finish stronger than you started. Remember, that's more mental than it is physical. Last 10, best 10, push. Finish stronger than you started. Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> and relax, baby. All right, there we go. Again, I wanna go back to my football days and we'll do what we call Heisman, okay? So a Heisman is a lateral, step into a pose where I'm gonna work on balance, stability, and core strength, okay? For modification, one, two, three, reach, one, two, three, reach. Try to get one foot off the ground. So again, you work balance, stability, and core. Three, two, one, showtime. One, two, Hosman. One, two, Hosman. Keep going, baby. That's right, channel your best football moves. As a matter of fact, in the comments, tell me who your home team is. Good. Here we go. Push. And everybody is undefeated right now. So it's the best time of the year. Keep going. One, two, Hosmer. One, two, Hosmer. Good job. Chest up. Shoulders back. You're moving side to side. If you have enough room, go forward and backward as well. Really work on mobility and agility, balance and stability. Chest up. Eyes forward, 10 seconds, last 10, last 10. Here we go, five, four, three, two, and one. Oh my goodness, guys. So here's the thing, we're not ending yet. So that's to be good news. The great news is, it's time to work core, baby. So we're gonna be right down on the ground. Give you guys a moment to get down there, breathe in, and out. We're gonna do bicycle crunches, okay? Now, when you do bicycle crunches, I want your fingertips right by your ears, not in a lock behind your head, all right? So we'll be here, and I want you guys to bring opposite elbow to opposite knee, nice and slow. For modification, keep those legs bent, exhale up, down, up, down. Ready? 60 seconds, let's have some fun. Here we go. Good, fingertips right by your ears. Embrace that core. Shoulders up, breathe in and out. At any point in time, if you need to modify, drop those heels down, opposite knee, opposite elbow. Again, I love bicycles because this works the entire abdominal chain, top, middle, bottom, and obliques. Keep working, breathe in and out. Last 12, last 12. Who's gonna finish strong with me? I know it's you. Keep going, five, four, three, two, and relax, baby. Oh man, we're almost there. Okay, so now let's get those weights back up and let's really work hamstrings, glutes, and calves. We'll do what we call straight leg deadlifts, okay? I want you to stand with your legs 
about hip width apart or slightly less, slight bend in your knees, okay? So we're here, let's let our weights drag down the front of our body to your mid shin, and then come right back up, driving those heels down and hips forward. You guys ready? Five, four, three, chest up, and go. Let those weights drag down the front of your legs to your mid shin, back should be parallel to the floor, bring those hips forward. I'll show you from the side. We're here, butt back, neutral spine right here. Come up, squeeze the glutes, shoot the hips. There we go. Neutral spine here, up, slight bend in the knees, squeeze. You'll really feel this in the back of your legs and in those glutes, squeeze, good job. There we go, breathe in and out. Exhale, outstanding. There we go, now remember, if you need to modify, then you just shorten your range of motion to your knee and then come on right back up to your knee and then shoot those hips. Good job. Remember, exhale on effort. So as you come up, breathe out deeply. In, take your time. Out, we got five seconds. Five, four, three, last rep. Two, one, finish strong. Oh baby, I felt that force that you guys generated with those hips and I love it. Okay, so you guys are gonna love me for this one. I know it, so you're welcome already. This one is burpees, okay? And when people hear burpees, they're like, hey, I really don't like to do things that challenge me that much. And I'm gonna show you guys how you can modify it and take one step at a time until you really love burpees, okay? So we'll take it slow and then we'll ramp it up when you feel necessary. So it's gonna be one, two, three, four, and back up. Take it nice and slow. Now if you can ramp it up, you can go one, two, three, four, and come on back up. You choose, we got 60 seconds, baby. Make up your mind, tell yourself I can and I will. Ready, let's go, one, two, three, four, and back up, good. One, two, hands down, now step out, step back in, and come back up, there we go. Until you get comfortable with the body mechanics, you don't wanna go too fast, okay? Because speed doesn't always equate to results. All right, now if you wanna ramp it up, then here we go. Ready, let's jump, one, two, three, four. There we go, one, two, three, Four, keep going. Up, come on down. Push up, explode, that's plyometric. Again, if you're still doing a modification, you should be here. Step out, step back in, hips raised. We got five, four, three, two, one, and relax. Hey, listen, if you tried it, if you finished it, you got me and I got you and we smile together because together we can do anything. Last exercise, give me everything you got. So this one is just gonna be a squat hold. So if you have a wall, you can rest against the wall, slide your back down so you're about parallel up. I'm gonna do it right here and just hold in this position. You guys ready? Take breaks when necessary. In, in and out. Last one, in. Tell yourself I can, I can, and I will. And let's go, 60 seconds. Showtime, hold it. Butt back, chest up, eyes forward. Remember, if you're home, modification, put that back against the wall and slide down till you feel comfortable and hold it right there. Hold. If those legs start shaking, just smile, baby. They say, where you been all my life? Hold it. Hold it, breathe in. And now, we got 20 seconds. Finish strong with me, guys. Mental toughness, mental toughness. Your mind controls the body. Five, four, three, two, and guys, that was awesome. I love the effort. I love the attention, the detail, the form, and the technique. But you guys know, a great workout has a warm up and a cool down. So let's cool down, okay? I want you to stand about hip width apart, chest up, shoulders back, hands above your head, hold it there, and really get a good stretch. Try to get your chest up towards the ceiling. So you should feel it right here along your abdominal chain and in your low back right there. Hold it. Exhale. Outstanding. Now take your right arm across your body. Love on yourself. Smile big, baby. Be proud. Proud of your effort. Proud of your minutes because they were mighty. Breathe in. 
and out. Switch, left arm across the body. Use your right to pull it close. Remember your form, remember your posture. So you don't wanna be hunched over. Stand up proud and pronounce. Five, four, three, two, one. All right, let's do a couple of arm swings, alternating which one is on top. Good, this is a really good stretch for your chest. Outstanding. All right, now lastly, let's stretch out those hamstrings. All right, so we're here. We're tall oak tree. Exhale down. Your majestic waterfall. Chest to your thighs. Nose to your knee, baby. Hold it. Let's do it one more time. Exhale. And then, good. Hold chest to your thigh. Nose to your knee. And baby, that was awesome effort. You guys did it. As a matter of fact, let's do I did it dance together, babe. You did it. Uh, we did it. Hey, hey, you did it, baby. And you did it, dance. If there's any movement that you want to show, you want to express that happiness that you just got to the end of the workout. Now, remember, guys, we're here Monday through Friday with more workouts, more content to keep you guys moving and grooving. And if you're headed back into the gym, please remember to be clean, considerate so that we can all gym confidently. Now, until next time, I'm Teddy Savage. I love you. Love on each other. Peace.